Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. It is Sprout here back with another news related video. This time it is in fact Warzone Mobile. Now, a lot of scepticism, skepticism, whatever the word is, has been going around about this title for some time. Whether or not it's been true, it got rumoured months ago last year, middle of last year, something like that. And a lot of people have been sort of sceptical if it's actually real or not. However, in this video, I'm going to show you that it is, in fact, real. So, without further ado, guys, if you do me a massive favour and like the video, and make sure, if you're not already subscribed, to subscribe, as I do daily content uh, that includes gameplay, news, live streams. So, if you're looking for something to watch daily, make sure you hit that subscribe button. Anyway... What I'm not going to do in this video, guys, is lie to you. Now, a lot of other content creators, YouTubers, whatever, are going on and on about, we've got this confirmed, we've got that confirmed, it's coming this year, it's coming this year, whatever, this month. It's all nonsense. Nobody has got any solid evidence of the dates regarding the game. However, what I do have in this video is some actual evidence that the game does actually exist now obviously it's in development stages right now there's no close beta as that we're aware of or alpha versions or something we can only speculate on how far in the development the game actually is so what i'm going to do is i'm going to go through a couple of screenshots here for you so you can see exactly where i'm coming from with this information now first of all i ferg if you are familiar with this content creator youtuber uh, he's a <coughs> excuse me very big call of duty mobile content creator he's partnered with call of duty uh, slash activision so when he says stuff like this people kind of believe him and there's a couple of tweets here where he's actually sort of talked about he can't wait to play warzone you know but nothing solid on when just the fact that He's aware that it's coming sort of thing, but he can't say much more. It's usually the case with these sort of things. They'll be in a strict uh, non-disclosure agreement. They're not allowed to say this, not allowed to say that, but they can hint towards it without really going over the terms of the con uh, contract sort of thing. Now, this next one is by Lika. Very good reputation, Lika, from actual war zone of our Call of Duties and stuff. He's doing a lot of things along them lines. Not sure where he gets his leak from, mind you, but... He seems to be trustworthy, and a lot of these predictions have come true. He has also confirmed that Warzone Mobile is a thing. Now, he hints in another tweet that he's going to be talking about it and leaking more things for Warzone Mobile in 2022, which I think is why a lot of people are assuming that the game is coming this year. However, I think, personally, we might see a beta test or a closed beta, or maybe some you know, private access to certain content creators for the title sometime this year. No telling whether it'll actually come out this year, which is what a lot of people are seeing, which I find quite false and misleading, whatever. Now, the last one, which is the only concrete proof I would say that the game is actually coming, is this job listing from Activision slash Call of Duty Mobile Corp, whatever you want to call them, where they're actually looking for this job listing for w z m i e warzone mobile what else could it be of course it's call of duty it's going to be warzone and of course a mobile version now like i say i've got no concrete proof none of this is proven but this is what all the leaks and all the hints are hinting at and this is what i believe and a lot of people believe is what is happening however not what we don't know is what sort of game it's going to be if it's going to be cross play with other platforms you know versus pc i really don't think they will do that i don't think they'll go down the fortnite route because that would literally limit the game to high end high spec phones and i think with the success of call of duty mobile for instance they're not going to want to move away from you know everybody being able to play and oh, well only only the people with the good for ones can play you know what i mean i don't think they're going to really do that because that would just be kind of stupid to miss out on potentially in their eyes lots of revenue from you know the game so like i say time will tell if it's going to be high-end phones or not i'd imagine it's going to be mobile only but like i say no further evidence has been submitted but when leaks do come when news do, does come i will be reporting on it because i'm 
quite looking forward to this title myself. So, like I say, guys, if you would do as a massive feel, like the video, make sure you subscribe. And like I say, I do daily content. And if I'm going to be, if there's going to be any more information on this game, you will find it on this channel. So, thanks for watching, guys. And I'll see you in the next one. Bye for now.